Boom, bitch! What's going on, Gaming Legends? We are starting this video off with a, bang, a noob tube bang. What a cunt! So, like I was saying, uh, this is that Modern Warfare 2 gameplay from the other day that I promised you guys. Sorry I haven't uploaded the last two days. Um, what was it, Monday? YouTube decided that uh, I wasn't going to be able to allowed to upload. And then uh, yesterday, I ended up working a 10-hour shift at work with no breaks. So, yeah, that was fun fun uh, let me tell you guys um, delivering for 10 hours straight no bueno but uh, I got through it and I didn't kill anybody or myself and so um, I'm here making this video for you guys here today and I wanted to apologize for that because I said I'd get this video up two days ago and it's not but I'm gonna make it up for you guys cuz guess what's coming tomorrow we got some live autistic rage I'm gonna sit down on the sticks and hopefully try and get some nice two or three rage sessions recorded for you guys and then uh, I'll try and post those weekly because I know how much my subs love my rage so I will get that going for you guys um Many props to uh, those of you guys who are still sticking around. I provide a variety of content, so a lot of you guys can enjoy what I have to offer, such as this kid getting raped with the spaz. What up? Um, I gotta say, I I'm kind of like loving and hating Modern Warfare 2 at the same time. Um, the fact that my AC 130s almost never get me a nuke anymore is extremely frustrating. Cause you know, if I'm gonna go for a double nuke, I have to get my first one inside my AC 130. You know. I almost double nuked Afghan and uh, earlier in the week that I got this gameplay and uh, you know I got my first AC-130 and I finished with like five kills that I need for the nuke and I get four of them and then I get tubed and it's like come on it's Afghan how the fuck can my AC-130 not get all the kills I need for me to get my next AC-130 to finish off the game with a nice solid double nuke for you beautiful people but in my opinion, it's it's like a love-hate relationship because I feel like the gameplay is a lot more excited, exciting for you guys when you see me running around with like a shotgun or an MP5 low on ammo and you're like, what in the fuck is he going to do to pull off this nuke? I mean, the title says nuke, but he's still got like eight kills to go. Like, how's he fucking do it? So, uh, I feel like that also creates kind of an exciting gameplay for you guys. Um, Quarry with the uh, extended mags, MP5. Um... I gotta say, because of Black Ops 2, I've changed a little bit of my kits on Modern Warfare 2, which is weird because the crossover shouldn't be the same, but I'm liking the fact that um, I can run unsilenced SMGs and still do very well. Um, with Black Ops 2, you know, that's a must. Modern Warfare 2, prior to this, I wouldn't even think about running a unsilenced weapon unless it was like the FAMAS or the ACR. Um, never an SMG because your everyone's go-to kits that beautiful silenced uh, MP5K or uh, UMP. But that is the video. Thank you guys for watching. I will have some rage for you guys tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. I love all of you guys. I hope you all had a fantastic New Year's and hopefully I'll be uploading daily from here on out. New Year's resolution 101, baby. Love you guys. Peace.